was the CEO of the organization? Eri Marit Ramadan. Eri. Were you there as and when the alleged tender processes were uh, taking place? No. Who was it? Terry Ramadan. Terry Ramadan. Therefore, the issues that you are testifying before this assembly, are they issues that you saw, perceived, or they are issues that you are told? One, there are issues that my appointment... Were you told or you saw? I am... It's a simple question. I was not told. Yes. Neither did I see. At what process you are not told and neither you never saw? I was involved. You were involved? In at, at the, the time investigations. you joined the organization, what stage of the tendering process was it? The tender had just been terminated. There were investigations. The tender had been terminated? Yes. You therefore never participated in that particular process whatsoever for, for whatever purpose, yes? I participated in a very big way. All right. In the Would you then lead this assembly to understanding your participation in that tender? This matter was a matter that, one, What that exactly program. did you do that relates to this tender? I participated in the investigations on this uh, tender. So by you participated, ESCC, excuse me? By PPRA, by the Senate, by the National okay. Assembly. But at the time when the bids were alive, the bidding was alive, you had not joined. I was not in Kemsa. And therefore the issues you are testifying before this assembly are not issues that you witnessed not issues that are executed thank you now what was the status of the tent at the time you came or you joined i actually joined kemsa as a result of this tender now i'm not asking why you joined what was the status the tender had been terminated the tender had been terminated do you know of any company that is associated with the deputy president that succeeded in this particular tendering process for purposes of you know or you do not yes, know yes shobika had been yes. Uh, had been recommended for award but and since it was, was cancelled it, did not proceed was the award granted to shobika no do you know why the award was not granted yes i know yes because uh global fund do a pre-award review of every evaluation of global fund funded tenders and after doing a pre-award review they did not agree with the technical evaluation committee that so had evaluated the tender and recommended for cancellation of the tender thank you you've answered so it's as a result of the review of all the the bids that culminated into the cancellation of the tender correct yes and how many companies had bidded in that particular process I cannot remember, but maybe seven, nine or seven, I cannot remember. You cannot remember because you never participated, yes? Yes or no, Mr. Witness? If, if I get the record, I would, I would remember. And I so show him the records. Okay. He has it. Show him his affidavit in volume one. In that volume one, that is at page... Honorable Senators, the National Assembly, volume one, at page 67 and 68. Did you indicate the companies that participated in that process? I did not indicate the companies that... Yeah. You chose to conveniently refuse to indicate them, correct? Uh, correct or not correct? I don't need an explanation. Not correct. Why didn't you indicate the companies that participated in that particular process? My affidavit you have is premised, has explained it. My affidavit is premised on... Okay, I know your affidavit. Yes. I have read it several times, but my question is very specific. Why did you leave out the other companies that participated in the process? For purposes of, the, of my affidavit, I did not find it necessary to include. Never thought it necessary. Now, confirm that Shobika company was never ever awarded the tender. The tender was cancelled. tender was cancelled. Did the Republic of Kenya 
lose any money as a result of the award not being granted to Shobika? Yes, it did. Did the deputy president have anything to do with it? The, the did document... the deputy president have anything to do with it? I wouldn't say the deputy president. I'm asking, you know, we are no. here because of the deputy president. Did he have anything to do with it? A company related to... I'm asking, did he have anything to do with it? It's a simple question. Yes Pass. or no? I already have... Yes, uh, and you'll, you'll, you'll furnish me with an answer. I've said yes, because the company that is associated with him had been irregularly awarded. Had been irregularly awarded. Did, do you know that this matter was subject of investigation by Parliament? Yes, I am. Did you participate in that investigation? Yes. Honorable Senators, refer with me to page, at page 183, volume 3 of the Deputy President's Bundle. <laughs> volume 3, Honorable Senators. That is the report. We'll go with me to page 220. At page 220, Mr. Witness. Can I get the document? Give him, give him something. Give him the copy. You, you can get volume three for him. Volume three. Page two twenty. You can you see confirm that those were the companies that participated in that particular tender, yes? Seventeen bidders. At page two twenty. Yes, there are some seventeen bidders. There are, how many are they? Seventeen. Go to page two twenty one and you read can you see where it is written one hundred? Yes. Can you read out that statement? In its report, dated 25th April 2023, Global Fund noted that KEMSA had failed to apply evaluation criteria consistently to all bidders and that none of the bidders met the minimum requirements. None of the bidders met the minimum requirements. How many bidders did not meet the minimum requirement? For purposes of this report, what the Global Fund is talking about are the 17. All the 17. Yes. And therefore, Shobika was not an exception, correct? Shobika was not an exception. It never qualified, correct? Yes. Now, look at where we have page, uh, at paragraph 105. Yes, can you see where we have Roman B? So we have B. Can you see B? 105, paragraph 105B. Uh -huh. Yes, can you read what B says? A global fund document reported that the bid bond for Shobika Impex was not paginated and the management of KEMSA argued that the bid bond was not part of the bid but was rather an accompaniment. What, is that, what does that mean? I think I had not thinking, this. reading, and understanding. It means, and I had said exactly the same, that this document was not submitted as part of the 